Hi, this is Jim, and welcome to A Quick Cup of Coffee with Jim. Today's topic is multiple results tasking, or in a way that might offend some people on Twitter, uh, another way to look at this is how to kill two birds with one stone. In the last video, what we said was trying to multitask was turning your brain to mush, making you unhappy, and leaving you with no energy. So then the next thing we talked about was linear tasking or linear results tasking where basically you figure out what you need to do and you put it on a post-it note and you put it on the corner of your monitor and you only do three at a time. Now I want to talk about multiple results tasking which is where you get multiple results with fewer actions. Now here's one way to think about it. I want you to think about a cowboy and the cowboys in a shooting competition okay and he's shooting at bottles and cans and targets and each time he shoots he accomplishes one thing. Takes out the bottle, takes out the other bottle, takes out the can, hits the target. And this right here is the equivalent of linear results tasking. This is really what it is. Lining up your bottles and shooting them one at a time. Now what I want you to do is to imagine our cowboy and he's still got his gun, but now what I want you to imagine is if he were to line up everything one behind another so that you have your bottle, you have your second bottle, you have your can, and you have your target all in a line. And he shoots one bullet and he hits four targets. That is exactly what I'm talking about when I'm talking about multiple results tasking. Shooting one bullet and taking out four targets. Now, what would be an example of this? Well, an example of this would be, okay, we take off our cowboy hat and we're back on our info marketer ebook publisher hat. And we're trying to get some things done. And we have this giant list. Well, I need to do a Kindle book, and I need to do some videos, and I need to do some articles, and I need to do some Facebook, and I need to do some blog posts, and I need to do, I need to build a hub page, and I need to build a Squidoo lens, and, well, I need to create some affiliate tools. Whoa! That's a huge list that if you did linear tasking, this could take a really long time. But now, let's think like a multiple results tasker. And what do we need to do? Well, think about this. You got your Kindle book, you got your videos, you got your articles, Facebook, blog posts, hub page, Squidoo Lens, affiliate tools. What you really need to create this is one big chunk of text or one big chunk of content. So what if you put on your little headset and you did a teleseminar? Okay. And let's say you answered 20 questions. All right. So we do a teleseminar and we answer... 20 questions. Each question, let's say we take three to five minutes with each one. That means we now have about 60 minutes worth of content. It means we have about 30 pages if we have it transcribed. It means we have 20 chunks of content because each question is a chunk. Now, we take the transcript and we turned it into a Kindle ebook. All we have to do is just go to Fiverr or something and get a cover. Videos, you can take your audio 
and you can add PowerPoint slides to it. Articles, bang, each one of these, you've got 20 articles that you can turn each question into. Facebook, easy. You just post one of these articles up to your website and then do a little teaser and tell people they can go read the article. Blog posts, each one of these questions could be a blog post. Hub page, each one of these questions could be a hub page. Squidoo lens, take three to six of these questions and turn it into a Squidoo lens. Affiliate tools, bang, just take some of these questions and take some of these articles, take some of these videos, and you give them to affiliates to use. So, instead of sitting there feeling like, okay, damn, I gotta write this book and I gotta make these videos, if you just do a teleseminar where you answer 20 questions thoroughly, you have created the basis for all these things that all of a sudden it's really easy to get on down the trail with those. So what's your action step? Just try this new technique out. Think like the cowboy. And I'm very curious to hear how you do with this little twist to a mindset. If they can get past the thought of multitasking, most people think in terms of lining them up and shooting them one at a time. That's how most people think if they can get off of the off the multitasking bandwagon. What I'm telling you to do is to then think in terms of one bullet taking out multiple targets. Give it a try. This is really the secret of how I'm able to get so much done in so little time. And if you want to get your own ebook done quickly, you owe it to yourself to check out 7dayebook.com. If you're serious about writing, publishing, and selling an ebook and getting up and running in seven days or less, this is the exact course you need. Do it today.